We're going live here in Minnesota at JW Soul USA. Guys, this is what happened. We were on live stream telling you guys all what is happening here because I have this is a troubleshooting outback troubleshooting the mate three. So this is what is happening, guys. Um, I lost the stream because I was on live stream. I was gonna just finish up and I was demonstrating how um, to get back and charge your batteries. But I said the warning at uh, 60 so that 60% um, state of charge my batteries, sorry, uh, at uh, 60 volt my batteries to send me a warning that I'm getting low or about to get in trouble with my batteries. So what I did, the amber battery starter light here, that's after 80% um, that lights will go, come on, sorry. That light will come on and telling you that you just passed the 80%. And this is a five days process. I've been five days without sun um, at my location and uh, these batteries were doing and I wasn't getting zapped. Right now, I can show you right now what is going on here. Nothing is coming, say like a 6.6 .6 watts just flashing because the weather is so cloudy outside that um, it was raining. We got snow apart here in Minnesota and I set the batteries to be that way and there uh, was a warning that came and uh, I was busy. Um, installing Grillmeister Dave's system. So I've been gone in and out for the past days. If you can watch my videos, you see how busy I was. Um, not neglecting my batteries or my investment, but uh, I was busy with other things because if you build a system right, it's supposed to take care of itself. And I don't have it on the internet so I can monitor it but I can still, when I come home, the first thing I'm going to do, check on my system. So the troubleshooting the Outback power system with the May 3. And now we're charging the battery at 7.8 kilowatt at, um, here in Minnesota. Uh, winter time, we go to 9 cents, my area. And the other side, um, they're paying something different. But I'm paying 9 cents on winter and eight cent at summer so this is what it is guys and um still making borrowing power and charging the batteries this is i'm gonna correct the troubleshooting um the the, the parameters i set for my batteries to give me a warning alert that i have to take an action and this is an action i'm taking out right now here at the command center of the JW Solar USA, which we are not making no power at the moment. So this is what it is. And um, um, uh, like I said, if you're on the stream, you saw exactly what it is. I can't just go back and do all over this because um, <laughs> I just missed that stream was gonna be awesome, awesome uh, uh, um, update about the system and five days without charging the batteries and that's outstanding guys so let me show you the batteries here stay tuned speaking about the lithium ion battery let me take you to the battery box these are my batteries folks and I on the left corner here is a Chrysler Pacifica batteries which I have two stack Two are stacked together in parallel two, and there is another one here. So I have six of them, and over there you can see I have um, th those are Ford Focus batteries, which are uh, Ford Focus batteries. We have a two strings of those, and which is a eight kilowatt over there. And check this out here. These are the Chrysler Pacifica 
each battery is a 2.6 kilowatt 2.6 kilowatt on each battery so these are the ones I'm running right now and they've been running for five days without having no power in and stay tuned because you're gonna be seeing a video again troubleshooting my system like I said I'm gonna be putting some new boss bars if you watch the video on my playlist with the Grillmeister Dave how we were making the uh, boss bars videos I've been showing you guys for so long and now we're gonna be in business and here you're gonna be seeing another big stack of batteries which is um, 8.544 kilowatts of Volkswagen e-golf this is my lithium power storage look at how tall this thing is so guys I have some batteries and I got some stuff that is not even uh, getting to the system yet I've been working on my system I haven't completed my system I have to go and help Grillmeister Dave because we were putting his system together and this system check on the playlist you see this is gonna be identical to his system so it's just like um, uh, the same process and uh, he has there I have that so that's a 48 is a Magnusign Magnum um, MS 4024 PAE and uh, now this is the odd back power system which is the the X um, FX 3048 MT this is a mobile version and I have the midnight classic up there um, 250 this is the full version that has the um, arc fault ground fault protection all the bells and whistles on it this is the complete version it's not like the CP okay so this is my system and if you worry uh, wondering how my system looks like and this is what is powering my house right here at a JW Solo USA and thanks for watching and sorry about missing the live stream we just have a bad connection so that's why I'm not even um, trying to do the live stream that much because I don't just trust it but um, I it, it just lost a lot of information how you can troubleshoot your Outback power systems or Outback power product so live here at the JW Solar USA Love you guys all and stay tuned for more to come live from this station. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. We are still trying to replenish. If you're on the stream, then you got it. Well, if you're not on the stream, you just missed it. There's a lot of information, but I'll do that again sometime. Maybe part two of that. Stay tuned. Love you guys all. That's the Outback Power. Uh, the mate three here so till I got to the 80 percent the battery starter light will go away and become green and as soon as I pass the voltage I set the threshold and the event lights gonna go away we are sitting at 61.9 right now okay bye for now from Minnesota your guy JW subscribe and share